Braves country. Welcome to Truist Park in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm Otis. For weeks, we went on a nationwide search to find the next public address announcer. The finalists are here. Are you ready for this? It's exciting, right? Let's meet our celebrity judges and get into all the action. Eddie Perez, Timothy Miller, and Paul Berg. Now let's meet our contestants and check out their auditions. First up, you've probably walked around Truist Park with him. He wants to go from Atlanta Braves tour guide to Atlanta Braves PA. Here's Bobby Powell. Hi, I'm Bobby Powell from Albany, Georgia, as well as Atlanta, and have been a Braves fan for many, many years, and nothing would make me happier than to be the next PA announcer and follow in the footsteps of Marshall Mann and Casey Motter. Thank you for your consideration. That sounds good, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park, home of the Braves and the best MLB experience in baseball. So I was hoping on my first guy, I was gonna get a chance to make fun of somebody and laugh. <laughs> Do up for your Atlanta Braves in the bottom of the first and number one, Ozzy Albies. Batting fifth, I need stronger. playing first base, number 28, Matt Olson. Will we go in there? Five yeah, I agree with it. Any yeah. food and beverage item at participating racetrack locations tomorrow. Okay. All right, you ready? Okay. This is our special request. Okay. We'd love to hear you hold the notes better, like an Ozzy. Okay. All right, Bobby, you got some notes from the celebs. And you up for your Atlanta Braves in the bottom of the first. Number one, Ozzy Albies. Well, thank you, guys. I appreciate the opportunity. All right, Braves country, you just heard the audition from Bobby Powell. Let's hear from our panel of judges. Do you think that that's something you'd want to walk out to and feel the excitement? You know, I can't wake up next to my wife and say, good morning, honey. <laughs> you know, that doesn't work. You do have to elevate with energy, and mm -hmm. I think it's a matter of doing that in front of the microphone. When you get to those superstar players, those moments for the fans, you know, they came to see these guys. They want to really hear their guys broadcast over the PA. Next up in our audition, she flew 2,000 miles to be here at Truist Park today, all the way from California, CJ Silas. Hi, I'm CJ Silas, and I am so excited to be here in Atlanta. I've been a baseball announcer at every level, except Major League Baseball. Currently, I'm the announcer at Cal Poly in California, and I'm excited to be in baseball, maybe even here. My mother would be so happy if you take a picture of me sitting here. Thank you so much. Good to see you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park. Home of totally different, right? Oh, <laughs> totally <laughs> different. It's time now for the Atlanta Braves ceremonial first pitch. Tonight, Governor Brian Kemp will throw out the ceremonial first pitch. Let's see what you got, Governor. Batting fourth, playing third base, number 27, Austin Riley. Take a breath. Yes. Yeah, she's she's like running sprints. A little, but she's trying to release. She's trying to release, get back down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And don't forget to catch all the Braves action when they're on the road on Bally Sports South and Bally Sports Southeast. That's what's most important is how she says Bally Sports. Mm -hmm. Please buckle up and drive home safely. So long, everybody. That's it? That's that. <laughs> did she collapse? She just went out of the view. No, she's back. I think CJ did an awesome job. Um, I mean, the, the energy is, is certainly something that jumped off. At, but, but yeah, I think she did a great job. Dogs Nation, you know the next person up auditioning. You've heard his voice. He's been a part of the UGA Athletic Association for many years. Sam Franco. Brave country. My name is Sam Franco. I want to be the next PA announcer of the Atlanta Braves because I was born right here in Atlanta, Georgia. Can't get much more Atlanta than being born on Peachtree Road at Piedmont Hospital. I'm your guy. Two, one. And now the starting lineup for your Atlanta Braves. There's that energy. Played by the manager, number 43, Brian Snitker. He may need to change of pants I after know. this. Wow. <laughs> number 54, Max. Free. I didn't know Max Fried was Spanish, but he rolled the R's. <laughs> yeah, baby. Eddie Perez, your thoughts? Love it. I love this guy. I, I heard him last year in the season. I love everything. So he's, he's so far, he's my number one guy. Up next in our audition process, he showed up at Braves Fest in our PA audition booth. He was in the right place at the right time, made it all the way to the finals. Larry Gardner. Hi, Braves country. I'm Larry Gardner, and I hail from the city of Adairsville, Georgia, and I would love to be the next voice of your Atlanta Braves. All right, Larry, you ready to go? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park, 
the voice uh, jumps right up at you, you know. How many times do you think he's practiced in that bathroom echo? <laughs> Enjoy tonight's contest between the San Diego Padres and your five-time consecutive division champion, Atlanta Braves. Braves country, get on your feet and make some noise. That boom's out there. That was there. good. That was good. Please buckle up and drive home safely. So long, everybody. Paul, Larry brought it strong. How are your feelings? I don't know if you guys picked up on this. I, I felt like he was from the South. Yes. That's important. That's right. He's already, you know, slowed himself down. So it was very, very impressive. Very impressive audition. Next up, Braves Country. You've probably heard him all over your TV. This is CNN Breaking News. I can't even do it like him. But you've heard the voice. Brian Welch is heading into the booth for your audition. I'm Brian Welch. I'm the voice of this is CNN Breaking News. I've been a Braves fan all my life. I think Braves fan broadcast career. I think I'd make a great addition to this great team with the Braves experience. Braves country, get on your feet and make some noise. On your way home, tune your radios to 680 The Fan or 93.7 point FM. 93.7 FM. He got off with the 93.7. Uh, and he was, I think he was trying to pace himself and get back on. Fans now catching, fans now catching number 12, Sean Murphy. Number 26, Rossiel Iglesias. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I like that. He had a little fun. I like that. I, I can tell he never did baseball before, uh, but you know, it's, it's not easy. I like his voice. Handling mistakes is a big part of this. He made a mistake on Iglesias. Recover. Next up in our audition process, he's been a PA announcer for the Gwinnett Stripers. Is he ready for the big leagues though? Here he is, Kevin Krause. Hey Braves country, my name's Kevin Krause. I live in Bethlehem, Georgia, and I have been the voice of Kure Field, home of the Gwinnett Stripers for the last 10 seasons. And I want to be the next Braves PA announcer because I have a great voice, I'm very knowledgeable about the game, and I'm a huge Braves fan. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park, home of the Braves, and the best MLB experience in Good baseball. Good voice, little robotic. And now, the starting lineup for your Atlanta Braves. Number 23, Michael Harris, the second. Batting sixth and catching. Number 16, Travis Darno. A little growl, a little growl. Yeah. It's time to send it back to Otis for the Napa Cap Shuffle. I like how he said my name. You like that? <laughs> now pitching for your Atlanta Braves, number 26, Rizel Iglesias. A plus? It's my A plus? one right now. <laughs> All right, that's it. Bang. What stood out is that each player had a signature way he said their name. I really liked him more and more as he went on to the point at the end, I would have to agree with that. He was my favorite so far. Moving on with our additions. He's been a minor league PA announcer here and there, but he's a man of many hats because he's also a business banker. Here's your audition from David Perry. Hey, I'm David Perry from the heart of Braves country, Augusta, Georgia. And I became a Braves fan in 1991. It's a real special thing for me and my family to enjoy the Braves and I'm looking forward to being here every single home game to enjoy the game with you. You got a weapon down here just in case it gets rowdy? Hi, I'm David Perry and I'm... hit that on button. Press it against you on There you go. Hi, I'm David Perry and I am so excited to be here for the auditions to be the next Atlanta Braves PA announcer. And now, the starting lineup for your Atlanta Braves. There's something unique about his tone, though. Batting like third, <clears throat> playing second base, number one, Ozzy Albies. On your way home, tune your radios to 680 The Fan to catch the breakdown of tonight's game on the Atlanta Braves Radio Network post-game show. So long, everybody. All right, thank you, guys. That audition from David Perry, really, really good. How are you guys feeling about his audition, Eddie? It's, it's, it's different, different from everybody. I liked all of it. Clean, crisp, clear. Comes across, across very polished. Somebody that you don't expect to have to worry about managing the flow of the game. Um, so yeah, I, I think it's, it's a very solid audition. 
Our next contestant, you've heard his voice from the Rose Bowl in Pasadena to the Plains of Auburn. He's a voice actor ready to show his voice off right here for the Braves. It's Mark Aston. Hi, I'm Mark Aston. I grew up in Columbus, Georgia. I live in Marietta, Georgia, and I want to be the next public address announcer for your Atlanta Braves. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park, home of the Braves and the best MLB experience in baseball. None of this counts, but he looks like a PA announcer. Batting <laughs> second, playing center field, number 23, Michael Harris the second. Wow. Batting sixth and catching, number 16, David Darno. David. Thanks for coming out and supporting your Atlanta Braves. Please buckle up and drive home safely. So long, everybody. That was Mark Aston's audition. Now, Paul, what were you thinking? Well, there's different types of voices. He has a great voice. He's very well trained. He's going to work in certain situations. He could have been a little better prepared. Auditioning next. Born and raised right here in Atlanta. Went to Decatur High School. Graduated from Georgia State University. He's ready to be your next voice, potentially, for the Atlanta Braves, Jonathan Payton. Hello, Braves country. My name is Jonathan Payton. I'm from Lilburn, Georgia, and I am here to be the new public address announcer for your Atlanta Braves. Now, I've been doing this for a number of years, and I'm just excited to bring the passion, my fan in for the Braves, and to show you guys what I can provide to the game day atmosphere. Three, two, one. Number 13, Ronald Acuna Jr. Wow. Nice boys. Yeah. Big bold. Mm -hmm. Number 27, Austin Riley. There's a natural relatable yes. energy with yes. him. Please buckle up and drive home safely. So long, everybody. Your thoughts, Paul? Uh, Best dress contestant. Very likable. Enjoyed the voice. He's the rookie you call up that gives up three or four and in seven innings. You say, hey, we're sending him back down. We're going to see you in two years. You're going to be a superstar. <laughs> Up next to audition from my hometown, if you've been to a Buford High School football game, you've heard his voice for the Wolves. Now he's trying to be the voice for your Atlanta Braves. Here's Kerry Claiborne. Hello Braves country, my name is Kerry Claiborne. I am a native Georgian, born and raised in the metro Atlanta area. I still live here with my wife and two daughters. I'm a lifelong Braves fan, and I want to be the next PA announcer for your Atlanta Braves. And Kerry, let's get to the introduction in three, two, one. Hello, my name is Kerry Claiborne, and I am honored to be here for the auditions to be the next Atlanta Braves PA announcer. My butter. Good start. Batting butter. fourth, playing third base, number 27, Austin Riley. Batting I fifth, need, I need playing more. first base, I need a number 28, a Matt Olson. I like this guy. He got highs and low, and I, th I think this. It's really good. Hey, if the Braves went 10 1 and Ozzy Albies went 5 for 5, yeah. you got to drag that name. No, you're out. not. You got to stay the no. same. No, so get win. on it. <laughs> it's a gas. Number 26, Rizel Iglesias. Perfect. That's it. Next up to audition, he's looking to go from the classroom to the booth. He's a teacher at Trinity Christian School. Ladies and gentlemen, Chris Litton. Hi Braves country, my name's Chris Litton and I'm applying to be the public address announcer for the Atlanta Braves. I'm from Noonan, Georgia, and there would bring me no greater joy than to be the new public address announcer and bring your fan experience to the next level. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park, home of the Atlanta Braves and the best MLB experience in baseball. He's pretty good. Yeah, he's pretty good. The gates are now open. And pitching, number 27, Ricey Iglesias. I put rice instead of rice up. <laughs> Eddie, how are you feeling about his inflection, about his energy? Love it, love it. I like that guy. He got a couple problems, but I think it's those, you can fix those. I really, really thought there was something about his voice that was very attractive. So it's from the, from the diaphragm, so he can, he can do that all day. Next up, Steve Henderson has been a voice for NASCAR, MLB, and the NBA. But is he the next voice for your Atlanta Braves? Here's his audition. Braves country, let's do this. I am Steve Henderson, and I really, really want to be your next public address announcer for the Atlanta Braves. Listen, I'm a fan first, and what's most important to me is your experience. So let's make this a good one. I hope you have a great time at the ballpark, and I really look forward to seeing you there. And Steve, we're going to 
and slide right to the gates open in three, two. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Truist Park. Enjoy tonight's contest between the San Diego Padres and your five-time consecutive division. He just scored on that. Right, right, he yeah. buried the Padres. <laughs> oh my goodness. Batting six and catching number 16, Travi Travis Darno. Okay. Batting seven. Get about the back. designated hit. This is the seventh or eighth inning. We've got some brave substitutions. Now substituting number 11, RC, uh, Orlando Arcia, left field. So the voice is definitely unique, and that's something that uh, you, you certainly look for. Consistency is certainly something that, that you want want to see a little bit more of. But overall, I think he did, think he did a wonderful job. No, I agree. He's like that pitcher that throws 98 on the black, perfect, two pitches, and then throws a couple off the backstop. It's okay if you mess up one. I get that. He messed up a number of times, but I love the voice. Good. All right, Braves country, you've seen the contestants, you've heard their auditions. Now get ready, because you're going to help the selection committee in their final vote totals. Watch our Brave socials and Braves.com as we continue our search for the next public address announcer. Big thank you to our contestants and our celebrity judges. I'm Otis. Let's go Braves!